Now when we have these six wire coils, wired UU, VV, WW with three phase power, we put a 40 millimeter magnet above it. And we have another 40 millimeter magnet below, which attracts the first one. When we start spinning it, it wobbles. 10 hertz, 15 hertz. There's no change of weight yet on the scale. When we get to about 19 hertz, it rises up, and there's no change of weight on the scale, even though it's way up there. Doesn't change the weight. Pretty cool, isn't it? If we change the polarity of that central magnet from red up to blue up, south pole up, we turn on the power, teared, and we go to the same 20 hertz, and yet there's again no change in weight. And it doesn't rise, even at 30 hertz. Forty hertz it might rise a little. There's still no change of weight for reverse polarity. That's fifty hertz. And when we change back to a north or red pole up and turn on the power. You see it rises very easily at about 20 hertz, much lower frequency. So both rises are the same, but one polarity of this magnet, north-south, works at about 20 hertz, and the other rises at about 50 hertz, and neither of them change the weight on the scale. We can also place a 60 millimeter magnet on the scale, and there's a 40 millimeter magnet below it down there. We turn on the power, 10 hertz, fifteen hertz, no change of weight on the scale. It's going way up in the air. Look at that. And the weight on the scale is not changing. This is just at 15 hertz. So, it's very cool, but it's not UFO propulsion. It's an electromagnetic top.